I'm speaking to you all in English right now. Why do I speak in English? Uh, I can make my content known to many people around the world by speaking English. And this is joy in being understood by them. The joy in being understood by them. Uh, in them. But the learning English is very difficult. Not only Japanese students, but also about saying I can't understand it or how can I say it? To solve this problem, what I would like to share with you on this page uh, is this uh, paper and pen, which you all use uh, in your everyday life. I will show you how to use paper and pen to facilitate communication and expand your world regardless of your English ability. I arrived this idea based on my fortunate and unreliable experiences with communication. I will briefly begin by telling you how I come to this realization. One day, I was returning, uh, returning to Chuk Sendria International Airport from a trip. It's a major airport in Ant Prefecture. And frequency used by foreign visitors. There are also a foreign tourist in front of the ticket gate. In my point of view, he seemed to, in, to be in trouble. I want to help him, and I was brave enough to take action. So I asked him, can I help you? My English is, uh, was not very good, but somehow I was able to figure out what he wanted to go to Sakae in Nagoya. To get to Sakae, you need to take the latest line and get off Kanaima Station and uh, take the subway major line and get off Sakai Station. Kanaima Station in Art Prefecture is a terminal station where trains uh, from several companies make it, JR, and subway. Therefore, changing train at Kanemo Station is complicated, difficult, uh, complicated uh, even for Japanese. So, uh, I thought, uh, uh, do you know the structure of Kanemo Station? On get on the subway, you have to turn right when you exit the major ticket gate, but you sometimes have to turn left when you exit your major, um, you exit the major ticket gate. This is because there are two ticket gates at Kanaima Station. Major ticket gate, major ticket gate, and subway. So uh, I thought I could uh, I couldn't explain him. Uh, this complicated way. Uh, then I came up with a brand idea. What I told him is that you have to uh, you have to change train at Kanaima Station, and you have to get the subway major line. The major line is purple, but he didn't understand. I told him Nagoya subway have each color and the major line is purple. But he didn't understand. <laughs> Do you understand? <laughs> I wanted uh, I wanted to him this the major sign 
I meant to write is purple. So uh, this uh, my great idea is to find a sign of subway and go to a sign of subway. I thought I didn't explain him complicated way for change the play and he could change the play, but he didn't understand. This is not a great idea. I don't know he could arrive at Sakai Station. <laughs> so uh, I regretted that uh, I I had spoken English better now. I was able to help him, but it it wasn't to be. Uh, in fact, I practiced and now. I can, uh, I can explain him that you take me the train, get a cup at Kanemo Station, exit me the ticket gate, go to a sign of subway, go down the stairs, enter the subway ticket gate, get on the subway major 9 clock by train, and get off at Kanemo Station. Uh, actually, I practiced this sentence hundred times for my talk, <laughs> so I can speak fluently. But did you understand? Uh, I will not understand it at all. All I could understand would be the word station. The important thing to communication to convey them what I mean. In this case, he can understand and he arrive at Sakai Station. This is really important. In fact, there are many people in the world don't use English. How should I uh, convey what I mean to those people? One solution is to simply study another language Spanish, Chinese, Arabic, Hindi. It's important to become multilingual and to study languages, but it takes a lot of, a lot of time and effort and it's impossible for many people. I believe my idea will help. Uh, those uh, a lot of people to understand. Uh, a lot of people don't use English. If you can use my idea, a lot of people can understand what you mean. My idea is to use paper and pen. Write, make notes. To use that to your advantage. And this idea is universal and is starting point of understanding complex things about each other. What would have happened if we had paper and pen? Let me explain again about changing time. I will show you a note. Chubu Kokusai Kuko Airport, waited train, the train, Kanayama, Kanayama Station, Chikate Subway, Major Sen Mirimari, Major Sen Mirimari, Sakae Eki, Sakae Station. If people can read alphabet, they can understand it. I have a purple subway map, it will be perfect. And to give the paper uh, is important. People are quick to forget, uh, quick to forget. It's difficult to remember many names of places from other countries. It doesn't matter. I can't explain it to him. It's not enough. He can understand. He can arrive at Sakai Station, 
This is important. It's difficult that he changed train at Kanema Station. If he see, if he see, if he sees Japanese alphabet as a picture, he may be able to change train. If he show the paper for another people, they can help him easily. I have told you about changing frame. You can use a paper for guidance. It's difficult to communicate, listen, and give information with only word and English ability. But you give them a paper on a map, they know the way. When it's difficult to communicate, or communicate with uh, in words. If you have a paper, the chances of getting the message across are much greater. And actually, a technical staff member of the Kosen, I use the paper for explaining to students. It looks like this. It's impossible to explain for students by voice alone. It is a for students to understand if I explain them with paper. The paper can help communication even in native language. Notes are an important tool for communication, no less important than language. The important thing is communication and to add to mutual understanding. We live in an age of convenience uh, with prayer, uh, paper, notebooks, and smartphones all available. But there is a huge uh, universal quality to paper, and there is not dependent on any electric device, then electric device or vendor. Let's start, uh, let's start with communication using, using simple notes. All you need is paper and pen. It's not how good English is. It's your passion. That is important. Thank you for your listening.